Okay, welcome to the personal property tour for 45 Main Street in Strathguinness. Yes, it is behind me, but I'm needing to get to the end of the entrance to the, to the, the actual um, driveway itself. We are at the main road for Strathguinness. Let me pop the camera and show you. Here it is right here, it goes there. But you're a way back down here, so you're off the main road. This is all yours. This is the star all the way down. If gardening's your thing, fantastic you can change that into a vegetable plot or anything like that if you need more off street parking than everything that you've got here then you could convert that as well for that but it's a huge plot that this is on now this is a this is all yours but 47 has access just into their their property as well and um, so you can do a lot with this especially with these beautiful views over that field there in the countryside this is south facing by the way and the property is south facing as well look good double garage there up and over roller door you've got a one out, one out to the side you've got a shed for storage uh, you've got this all enclosed this is a great seating area now previous owners or the existing owners actually do this right now ideally positioned and laid out for taking advantage of the sun when it's out trust me it was up there earlier on so then we're sitting round about 11 14 so south is round about here so you're sitting in the sun all the time from morning till noon and dusk more than likely but this is the great thing this is all nicely enclosed We've got this beautiful front garden as well as i said all the property looks over that way let's go in the front door and talk about this now this was run as a former b and b before um, before this owner and um, so you know if that's what you want to do you could resurrect that and use that again there's a utility room off the back there we're not going to go in there it's a bit cluttered but it's a big walk-in utility area laundry uh, into the kitchen itself so breakfast and kitchen you can see space for a freestanding fridge freezer you've got your double oven you've got your space for your dishwasher and then you've got your hob and extractor over there in your breakfast bar perfect and then off into your dining room you might want to open that up possibility have a big open plan dining room kitchen but again these beautiful views following on that theme we're going to go upstairs first and see the two double bedrooms up here and then there's a couple of bedrooms down here there's a big bedroom here that you can subdivide again back into the, the, the six bedroom if you want to off to my right hand side good sized double bedroom in here actually a big double bedroom as we go round and again following on that these beautiful views imagine waking up to that every morning beautiful outlook isn't it all the way round here Brilliant. St Andrews is only 3.4 miles down the low road along there. And then off into the shower room. So a good sized shower room with thermostatic shower in here. And then the next double bedroom upstairs, again, similar size. You've got an ensuite shower room over there. You've also got a sink over here and a dressing room. Um, currently utilised as a craft room artist studio just now but that could be a dressing room for someone if they want and again out to the side let me just show you that plot again the size of that is huge that bit right up to the end of the drive and then your ensuite so your WC and your thermostatic shower and these views over here countryside views Brilliant, eh? Cycling's your thing as well, you'll love it up here. Uh, the um, St Andrews Triathlon have their cycling route up here. Uh, I've been on it. Okay, let's start round the back first. We'll talk about this one uh, in a minute. That's the two doors that goes into this one room, but it can actually be stud partition put back down there and actually create a sixth bedroom or a, another uh, room to, to use. But I'll, I'll show you that in a minute. So again, double bedroom in here, off to the rear. Similar theme with the sink there, and you've got behind the door, you've got your shower room. There you go, thermostatic shower and WC. Off into your bathroom, four-piece bathroom, you've got your bath over there and your rainfall shower. And then into what I would say is the fourth bedroom right now that we're talking about but this is the one that could be put back to the two double bedrooms again see the two windows to the rear 
but they used to have a stud in here many years ago right along there it was opened up to make it a big music room so it could easily be put back because you've got access through here and access through there again good size room eh sink over there and then off into the final double bedroom and here the sink over there as well and your ensuite shower with thermostatic shower again okay let's go into the front um, over on the left we've got this big massive sitting room window to the front and the side again these beautiful views and I'll show you that in a minute but it's a huge room you can see that and then you just walk right along there that's nice just sitting watching that every morning all day actually if you're sitting in here because this is your main living room It's a big property, could be a fantastic family home, or as I said, maybe want to use it as a B&B &B again, what it was originally before this owner, um, previously. And then out to the front, out the front door itself, you can see the seating's all perfectly positioned to sit in the sun all the way, all the way around. And you've got this beautiful lawn area to the front as well. This is a bit more blustery today than here have a look from there actually you can see the solar panels there's a surprise eh? <laughs> where it being south facing that's going to save you some money anyway let's flip the camera around and talk about the area for anybody that doesn't know Strathkinnis um, fantastic local nursery, local primary school, you've got a great local inn as well, Village Inn, um, uh, which does fantastic food apparently. And, and then over the hill towards Garbridge and Lookers, you've got the train station uh, on the Tensmere Forest, if you want the Fife Coastal Path and the beaches and everything else as well. And then you're three miles down the road, uh, down the low road or up on the high road into St Andrews, just over three miles um, to where all the main shopping facilities is as well. Okay, um, there's more details on this post, you can click on the link above or below um, for the photographs and descriptions. If you need to contact us, you can message us direct on this post or you can contact us on 01334 65 42 21. Until next time guys, I'm Jim Parker for 5 Properties TV.